What's good? What's happening, man? Listen, Jamari, shout out. We got it keeps getting worse for Adam 22. All right. Last thing I seen and read on is he's coming out with a show where five or six guys are competing to clap some cheeks. His wife. What is going on, bro? What is going on? So it seems like every time we have recently talked about Adam 22, it's always for a very embarrassing reason. <laughs> like most recently when he went on his podcast with two other men and was pretty much bragging about seeing a picture of Drake's dong. The skin oh, color matched up that. with the skin color that I would think that Drake's would actually be. And I'm not gonna lie, like I'm sure you're wondering right now, Adam, was it big, was it small? The man's got a missile on him. <laughs> like a, like a, a, a baby arm, uh, if you will. I mean, the way he was talking Fuck about you would think that somewhere tucked away. That boy glazing for real. Adam, what are you doing? <laughs> Yo. And like a what the closet in his house that he literally has a shrine of Drake's that he prays to every single night. I've been thinking about it for like months. Who can say they see Drake's for? Exactly. Other than that, we obviously covered the whole arc that lasted for a couple of months. Where Adam quite literally handpicked this black Terminator looking dude to bust his wife open on camera like a can of biscuits. Had a blast. Way more fun than expected. Holy Ooh, I could say the same about you. Do you think that you are better than Adam did? Well, obviously, yes. <laughs> Is He's a professional. Hard. What kind of question is that? This man's a professional. You're better than Adam did. Well, obviously, yes. <laughs> is it hard to go back to a, you know, reasonably sized white after dealing with a, a baby arm? <laughs> and obviously, the whole cuck arc brought him a lot of money and a lot of <sighs> attention. And Shit. I do think that when it comes to Adam, Fucking those guy. are his two main motivations in life. Because now him and his wife are pulling their latest stunt where they'll be hosting some sort of reality show competition to see who's going to bang his wife next. Yes, guys, I'm dead serious. He made the announcement on his this Twitter page. Where he says, who will be the next man to bang my wife? We create a reality show to find out. Drop it next week. And here's their little promo. Where do I audition? Where do I audition? Fuck is he? <laughs> Fuck for the new show. Hey, I'm Lena the Plug. I am an adult creator. My name is Adam22 and I co-own Plug Talk with my lovely wife. We interview a different girl every week. And then we f them at the end. But we've only ever done it with other women. So we've arranged this whole challenge to find the perfect guy to be our first ever boy boy girl. Cheers! Lena, I came ready to f Oh yeah, I would love to see a dance off. I see. I all right. Hopefully they show like uh like the the guys lined up. I'm gonna tell you who I want to go crazy with her, bro. I ain't gonna lie. <laughs> Not a fact. I see him. I'll, I'll pause it. This man right here. Get this man and make him winner, bro. Crip Mac. Get him. Come on, bro. Yo, hey, yo. Let me get in the room with her by herself. You want to get out? No, no, no. Get out. We're going to get you out of the situation. It's going so long to get this shit approved on YouTube. <laughs> on YouTube For is the crazy. Love of Lena. I mean, at this point, I'm pretty much left speechless. Like, I don't think I've ever seen a man pimp out his own wife on this scale. And I get that everyone's relationship is different and people allow different things, but I'm pretty sure a lot of the contestants featured in this show are some of Adam's good friends or some they people are, that they he's know. spending time around every single day. Especially Crip Mac. I've seen a bunch of memes of them together. I am pretty sure he's been on a bunch of like podcasts with him and shit on some co-host type shit, bro. And he is now encouraging them to fight to the death for a chance to bang his girl. That's f crazy. And if you are unironically paying for this, you have to be the most down bad individual I've ever seen in my entire life. Like you were worse than that guy who sits down in his basement watching Pokemon <laughs> streams all night, donating over and over again, just trying to get a little single drop of attention from her. Like I'm talking about the type of dude who for some reason in his sick twisted mind thinks he actually has a chance. I mean, just look at- Get this man, fuck everyone else. Get him to win, bro. <laughs> and it's not even because I want to watch it, just 
This a motherfucking funny dude right here, bro. That's just, it's just funny. You feel me? Get him to win. He better fucking win. I don't know who you is. I think he's a. I think he's another. Uh. Actor in the in the adult scene, right? I don't know who these are. Get this man to win, bro. Look at this image, guys. It makes me a little bit sick to my stomach. Just and I'm crazy, just gonna though. say what everyone's thinking. Why do they all have to be black? There's a lot here to be excited about. I think this could be very positive for our society and economy. Like, it is getting to infatuation levels at this point. Uh, I'm pretty sure this guy is, like, his good friend and co-host. Yes. Isn't this, like, a YouTube lawyer? What the f*** is he doing there? <laughs> so the entire video y'all just watched, I had filmed yesterday. Yes, bro. And I Kirk actually Mac. just wanted to pop in here to provide you guys with yet another update. Get him. This is Adam's friend and co-host here, Crip Mac. And I guess there is a little excerpt from the show where he talks about why he wants to be the big winner. It's Crip Mac. I'm here. Let you know I'm trying to win Lita's heart over. So I can bust her coochie in like she wants and treat her how she needs to fight get treated. I'm going to fight anybody over her. Hey, Lena, you're mine. Quit playing, dude. I'm going to cry. <laughs> I mean, just... Bro, he's just a character, bro. This shit You're funny. Playing, I'm a crap. I mean, does no one else think that he sounds like a crypt out version of Bill Cosby? I mean, this guy's gonna be sticking a put and pop into that thing. And the more I think about this whole situation, Yo. the more I question why people would want bro. to see their favorite corn star hook up with another D. Like at that point, aren't you just kind of like a cuck as well? Excited for the next guy to come into the room? Crazy. Like it's not on some Mortal Kombat shit <laughs> where you get a new person to fight with, you're just sick. Like while I do respect certain things about Adam and obviously the No Jumper brand and the way it's propelled <laughs> the content this is absurd. forward in a lot of ways, this type of stuff is just like, I will never understand. And it really does make I don't I don't I'll never understand. I never want to understand because this is fucking crazy, bro. Huh? Are you shitting me, bro? That's crazy. It can be question like how much is really real about their marriage? And was this all like a very contrived thing? Because the whole wife element just adds so much to this. If it was just like his girlfriend, I don't think as many people would care. But this is this man's wife. This is the mother of his kid. I don't know. I just... Bro, and she she got the she got the ring on still. I'm just noticing that. She's still wearing that ring, bro, shooting this shit. I just think it's the craziest like pimping out I've ever seen. Y'all let me know what you guys think down below. This is absurd, bro. I'm sorry. This is actually insane. Like he said, it's one thing for him to be a uh, boyfriend and girlfriend. But this y'all 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 married each other. You feel me? This is just absurd, bro. Just fucking absurd. You know? Having a tough day, but then I remember this guy suddenly my life doesn't seem so bad. Remember this guy? Oh, oh. <laughs> I thought he was talking about Jamari. I'm like, what do you mean? Uh, your consistent commitment to your craft. Yes, sir. Your journey as a creator. Yeah, fucking bots. Bro. Constantly see those comments. The skin color matched is an insane statement. The best thing everyone could do is ignore Adam and Lena forever. Pretty much. You know what I'm saying? They getting the attention, bro. Pretty much. Let me know what y'all thought. That's my reaction. If I enjoyed this video, like, subscribe if you haven't. And I'm out.